Chapman, the rebound, Lucic. Fed Nugent Hopkins, back door, and a hat trick for Jordan Everly. Dishing off Daniel Sedin, a steal by Connor McDavid. 99 points, looking to make it 100. Over the line, dishes off, back door, score! There it is, that's 100 points for Connor McDavid. The 2016-17 regular season comes to a close in style. Thanks to Jordan Eberle's hat trick and Connor McDavid reaching the 100-point mark, the only player to do so in the league this season in a 5-2 Oilers victory. That's been fun. Um, you know, we have a great, great group of guys in here. Uh, it's been a, a real treat to be able to play with this group, and you know, you see how the fans have kind of rallied around us, and um, you know, it makes coming to the rink and, and playing out there a lot of fun. You know, I got lucky on the first one. Nugent made a great pass in the third one, and the second one, I uh, just you know found a way to get it on my tape and get it off. So um, you know, some nights it's go like that. Some nights you could have ten chances and not score, and another night you have two and score two. So this is how it works. Despite the win, Anaheim managed to clinch the division tonight. The Oilers will square off with the San Jose Sharks in round one, a team Edmonton managed to go 3-1-1 one one against in the regular season, including two wins in the final six games of the year. The approach that we're going to take is we're going to play game 83. Um, it just happens that from 83 to 90, we're going to play the same team. Uh, but we're, gonna, we're not going to change a lot as a team. We don't really want to take our guys out of the... Um, rhythm that they're in. Uh, they've done a good job down the stretch and we just want to continue on doing that. We have a lot of confidence. Um, you know, uh, we obviously understand the, the experience knock that, that's going to be against us, but you know, we do have guys that, that have been there, have played there, guys who have won, uh, guys who have played in the finals. So you know, we do have that experience and, and we can rely on those guys. And um, you know, at the end of the day, it's still hockey. Um, you know, I think everyone talks about playoff hockey and all that, but it's still the game that we've all been playing since we were young. So. Um, I think uh, that part of it doesn't change. The Edmonton Oilers end the regular season with a 47-26-9 and record, good for 103 points. Connor McDavid becomes the first Oiler player since Doug Waite to hit the 100-point mark. Waite did it back in 1995-96. More importantly, McDavid is the first Oiler to win the Art Ross Trophy as the league's leading scorer since Wayne Gretzky accomplished the feat in 1986-87. Leon Dreisaitl finishes the year with 77 points, good enough to crack the top 10, making this the first time two Oiler players finish the year in the top 10 in league scoring since Yari Curry and Jimmy Carson did it in 1988-89. Also, Cam Talbot finishes tied for the league lead in wins. He ties Braden Holtby with 42. The Oilers return to the Stanley Cup playoffs Wednesday night for Game 1 against San Jose here at Rogers Place. Tom Gazzola, Oilers TV.